Cool, man. We're going to get to the reaction video uh, today. Are we? What we're going to start with is four. Yeah. Love and Thunder. How do you say it? Four. I say four. I say Thor. Okay. It's better well, effort, well, bro. To be fair, I've, I've been saying stuff wrong my whole life, so. Yes, I got excuse. So you can't. What's really, your excuse? You can't, you can't really hold. You can't really rely on me to make sure. I, make sure I ask bro, for the right. Punctuation. If you ain't got a, pr- a posh accent, you're pissed. Mm. It's either Thor or four. Yeah, because during those times, wasn't it the medieval? I'm so I'm so pissed off at the fact that they didn't call it four four. Nah, that's that's too chemical. Four four. <laughs> <four. laughs> I'm I've not watching a film that says four four. <laughs> I've seen that's that channel scene. four. <laughs> that would be cold, you know. More four. More four. Before we get into the actual trailer, do you want to talk a little bit brief about it? Okay. That's how he says, that's how he says no. <laughs> that's how he communicates. Do you have any comments? <laughs> My thoughts on it. Um, I'm not sure. Before, I wasn't too sure I wanted to watch this film in the cinemas. Yes. Um, you don't. You don't trust Tikiki with Titi. <laughs> What do you call him? Tikiki or Titi? <laughs> doesn't matter what I call him. My, my I is, him thing is, I really liked Randorok. Um, Randorok was... Um, Randorok. How you say it? Randorok. Where is it? Randorok. Where is it? It's not Ragnarok, no? Randorok. Wherever it's called, man. We need a compilation <laughs> with three episodes in. And it's really fucking up the half the fuck. <laughs> yeah. So when that came out, I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. Mm. I feel like it kind of revived um, for... Because so, so coming from dark, coming from dark world, which people didn't really like that much. Some people do like it. I think you want to. So, so did um Natalie Portman and Kristen Bell. Yeah, that's yeah. Why, that's when I remember you saying that last pod. Yeah. That's that's they pulled him in. So, but they're fair. Once once you mentioned it, then I'm seeing articles backing it up as well. I was like, okay, if they want to come back, then it might it must be a good film to watch. Um, and only thing I was scared was I didn't want Kristen Bell to be a job man. And I, and I feel like normally in these Marvel films, they they had, they make them like very comical. No, because even Hela wasn't comical. Hela was a serious was a serious uh, villain. Hela. Oh yes, yes, yes. She yes, wasn't yes, comical, yes, but yes, she, yes. She, she, you know what I'm saying? She was serious. So. Oh yeah, she was on crud, you know. Uh, well, Remember she, she had all those infinite knives and she was dagging everyone up. She's the goddess of, the goddess yeah. of death in it. So that's, well, yeah, so a it's, war. Was it goddess of death no, or war? Or death, death, yeah. No, yeah, not so. death. Is it death? Death or war. Maybe war. One of them. Someone's still dying. The, you know what I'm <laughs> Someone's dying. the result is the same. Doesn't yeah. care about the equation. Yeah. yeah. But now, yeah, he proved that he can do serious. I'm saying that even Jojo Rabbit, he had serious moments in there as well. Yeah. So. But that was like a dark comedy. But I see what you mean. Mm. So my my thoughts on it has changed. Um, I won't say I'm excited to look for, look to watch it, but I'm definitely gonna push to watch it like as soon as it comes out, opposed to before where I was gonna like lay back and just chill. You think he's gonna die? Um. He's the only one to get four movies. Yeah. I, I ain't gonna lie, to be honest, after this film, I don't think I need to see him again. Nah, man. There's nothing really more. What's <coughs> more, think, what, what, what more do you no, need No, no, he's not gonna die. He's gonna appear in um, Guardians 3. Oh, That's yes. Fuck it. Oh, man. I like not knowing, man. Like, this is yeah. why. My boy asked me a while back, he said, if you had a chance to work for Marvel, would you? I said, no, because Marvel is my entertainment. Yeah. Why would I want to know what's gonna happen? Yeah, it's part of the experience, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, knowing you're, things. You're getting like the five year plan. That's yeah, crazy. like that's you know, like shit. Like, but I wouldn't know about Doctor Strange six, before Infinity War. Like yeah. shit. Like what's the point? And no, nah, man. Like, I don't. I and like. The, and the mad thing is, that you you would have known what it could have been because a lot of times yeah, the yeah, story yeah, changes. Yeah, exactly. Especially so, like, Doctor, especially Strange. Yeah. But, so <laughs> the villain was gonna be Nightmare, and then you realize, oh, I was pushed for Nightmare. That changed to this, and like, yeah, it's just just, put a bad taste in your mouth. Because even if you're working, like, I mean, to be fair, they are really good at secrets. Like the only thing, the only people that get everything is like, even the CGI. Um, like the the VFX artists, they don't get everything. They just get what they they're seeing. Yeah, but they they divide the scenes between people, so they don't actually. Yeah, I remember the one bit for um, what's her name again? The, the woman that plays um Captain Marvel. Oh, uh, uh, um, Bra- Captain Bra- oh. Bra- 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 Lonson. Bra- Bra- Lo- say it again. What's her name? Go on. Say it. No, no, no. Go on. Go say on. it. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, Captain Bria Marvel. Lawson. What was her name? Not Brie Lawson, no. Um, Bria Lawson. <sighs> <laughs> was she like a, 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 a like a Hispanic lady with brown hair? She, she's nice though. I find her serious. I find her extremely attractive. Yeah, you know what? You find her attractive on, 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 on a G thing. I'm saying I got like she's she's whitewashed, but boy, yeah, she's white. Yeah, she's but do you like her as an actor though? Actress or they call it actor now. Right? Yeah, she did some stuff before the whole Marvel thing. She did some yeah, good yeah. stuff. There was one film called I think it was Room. Ah, uh, was Room something. Room number. There was a number. At the end, but she played someone that basically gets kidnapped and like, mm. and she, she was good in that yeah. yeah, she, I think she got nominated for Oscar for, for that film. What about, Captain, what about Captain Marvel? What do you think of her? I don't know, really. No, I don't like that much. As I, don't think I, feel, I feel like they just like in general making Captain Marvel like super powerful 
in this in this in the film compared yeah. to the comics. She's not that powerful in the comics. No, she's fucking. Insane. But she's not like as powerful to be like banging up four. Is she? Yeah, she didn't bang up four. No, in, in, not in four. Sorry, no Thanos. In, sorry. Yeah, but no, she didn't bang up Thanos. Remember, Thanos is tied because he has to beat up those three fucking dickheads. The, yeah. You know what I'm saying? The, the Holy Trinity. Yeah. Like people, people. This this is actually a really big thing that people forget to understand. It's not Captain Marvel versus four or versus Thanos. It's Captain Marvel fresh off the boat versus Thanos has had a fight with the, the, the Holy Trinity and then a bunch of other people. And then one day he had to fight one day, he had to fight the Trinity. He had yeah, to fight. Donnie's tired. <laughs> that shit. He wants to go to sleep. I like, give him five minutes. Bro, he had to use on. Yeah, like, yeah. When you watch a movie, you think about that. Think about how much endurance is part of this. <laughs> I said endurance. Think about the Bro, endurance of the character. Science. It's true, though. It's true. Think about it. Yeah. Because we forget about that shit. Like, even like, um, like uh, a goblin versus um, Parker. Oh, that Parker. was a cold fight. No, I don't like it. You know that fight? I think, I think it was. I, I, I would have liked it. I don't think the choreography was, was was amazing. Not the final fight. I mean the fight. Oh, in the, the in the in the hotel. Oh yeah, yeah. That, that, that fight that, was cold. Because man was, was like, banging his face, and I was just laughing. I was yeah, like, no, that, yeah, that's, that's that's the Green Goblin. That's insane. But you can see the wise. You feel like you can see the wise. I see what you mean. So yeah, that yeah, that, yeah, that yeah. bothers me. It yeah, takes yeah, me out yeah, of experience. Yeah, yeah. But regardless of that fact, these men are tired. <laughs> you think about the endurance necessary to fight. That's, that's why they have the Matt wires, bro. Thought, bro huh? <laughs> they need help. Yeah. No, no, not even the fucking. I'm saying the actual characters. Yeah, bro. I know you mean. Donnie right, fought right. four, God of Lightning with two, uh, two hammers. Yeah. Peak Iron Man. I mean, not peak, peak, but like close to peak Iron Man. Yeah. Close to peak, uh, Captain America with Mjolnir. Yeah. Then he had to fight the strongest being on the in the universe, Wanda Maximoff. Yeah. He had to beat fucking. He had to beat the flipping the the the. the the, the women's circle of flipping that was the maddest scene I've ever seen in my life, bro. <laughs> women are knighted. They, were knighted <laughs> they did it good in um, Infinity War, though. I like how they did it in Infinity War. How did you do it in Infinity War? It was, it was subtle. It was really subtle. Oh, yes. Yeah, so I know. I remember. I mean, it was really subtle. Because then, uh, what was that? The woman, one of the women that Prox, works Prox, with... Um, Proxima Midnight. That's her, that's her name. Yeah. Prox, she was Prox, like, Prox. oh, why did you keep her upstairs the whole time if she could do that? Remember when one day was... Oh, 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 Koye. Why was she up there all this time? Yeah, yeah. That's her favorite. Why was she up there this time? That's my favorite yeah. line, you know? Yeah. Like, the accent is so, like... You sound like an auntie. Yeah, <laughs> you sound, yeah. like, sound like my boy's auntie. Why was she up there this time? <laughs> you talk about another scene, then? Huh? No, I was talking about that scene. I was talking about that scene, yeah. Because that, that was... That was, that that was very subtle. I didn't even... In fact, the fact that you mentioned it, I was like, oh, wait, they're all female. I didn't even yeah. remember. I noticed it. Female. I noticed it in there, but it wasn't like... Like they were walking all cool yeah, and, and, and end game you know was like yeah, woman. The thing is, I did like the only thing I liked about that scene was the fact that Wasp came out of nowhere. Like she like, Zoo! and she's like, yeah, <laughs> that was hard. The rest of it was bullshit. That was hard. But dead powers, bro. No, she's like, she can fly. Her little, little BB gun. Be open, be open. <laughs> she's got a little she got BB gun. <laughs> she's like, you know those bosses <laughs> never hurt anyone. Give me you know? It's just tickle. <laughs> you know those? You know like, like it's hot right now in the UK, like. Bro, <laughs> that just bees like flying yeah, around. That's yeah. what she is, bro. Just everything. The, the inconvenience. Yeah. Nah, but she's smart. That's her thing. Is, is the yeah, intelligence. Yeah, intelligence. Well, nah, she's. I said pew pew. <laughs> they were BB gun. But yeah, oh, we're we gonna watch this show now. We need to watch this. Watch this trailer, bro. But there's do, so many points I'm trying to but, make here. But do you have any like thoughts in terms of this film? Are you looking forward to it before you press play? Or not? We're not. We're not meant to say that after the reaction, not before the reaction. We've uh, seen this film. We've seen this trailer. I before. mean, we 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 both seen it. Like, I, I think it's fine for us to admit that we've seen this trailer. But I thought we yeah, just play it and just give like a just give a little deep dive on it. Mm. See if you pick up anything while watching it. Of course, we can press press play and pause at any point. Oh no. On a, on a quick side note, quickly, um, I think we should start doing this thing on the sofa instead of actually like, on the table. Right? Oh, I've, yeah. seen those, I've seen those channels that do it on the sofa. They've got like bare toys and pillows. Oh, yeah, and make it seem more like a chill, chill yeah. environment. Yeah. When it comes to this kind of stuff, we should do it there. When it yeah. comes to the actual show. Make it look completely different from yeah. how it was. Uh, yeah, make it more like a living room type of, of setting. Because so, you're watching the trailer. That's yeah. how. Yeah. But anyway. Let's give this a watch, man. The person yeah, fucking that, that, idiot. That was so <laughs> Kids, get to popcorn and let me tell you the story of the space Viking, Thor Odinson. He was an ordinary man. He was a god. After saving planet Earth for the 500th time, Thor set off on a new journey. Well, he got in shape. He went from dead bod. I'm sorry, but you know how, how mad it is the fact that, like, he was depressed, you know. Yeah, for, for 10, 5 but, years. But like, they made it kind of comical that he was depressed. No, but yeah, no, mm, yeah, no. Like nah. he gained weight, he was playing, no, but he, he was playing he, Fortnite. You know how much, of, that was the biggest bro? product placement I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> when nah. I saw that, I was like, what are you if, doing? If you think that's the biggest one, look at the Audi ones. He's in, right? You no, the Audi ones ain't big. Obviously. I'll see you, mate. Yes, uh, you have, you have, you have keys to you. You have keys. Yeah, he's got keys. Can you lock us in, please? Okay, thank you, bro. 
Ej, man siger, man. Hey, round of applause, man. Fændig det show, fændig det show. Høj, hvor er det? Fændig det show. Høj, løj, 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 løj. Hvad var det, man sagde? Nå, hvad var det, man sagde? Ja, nå, Audi. Audi, de har den biggest. Jeg har ikke hørt Audi. Nå, det er det, det er det, det er det, Audi var Tony Stork. Tony? Tony. Tony. Tony Stork. It was um, the, you know the bit when he went to um, fuck man, yeah, we went to his to, lab. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 I'm saying, but, but the fact that the thing about Audi is that it's so regular that you don't even notice it. That Fortnite thing was a one-time thing, and then they announced that the Marvels entering the Fortnite yeah. universe. I want to see Fortnite in Star Wars. That's going to be funny because, but before you play, have you seen the most recent um, no, the, the first episode of Miss Marvel? Yes. She says, "Uh, um, one my next video is is my conspiracy theory on is for a gamer." Is. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like that's I like that intertwining world thing. I see what I'm saying. But he was depressed, bro. No, so yeah, so so he got he went past. So in a five year gap, he was so depressed in the first few years. We knew. I don't know if you experienced that. This, this. I liked your theory. We you, you had a theory um off camera about mm. how he went through so much stuff, and because he's a god, that could have been in that's the a space week. of a year or a week. Yeah. No, that, that 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 was a week for him. That whole ten year gap. That whoa. That was yeah. a mad weekend for him, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> from from flipping losing Loki in the first movie to losing half the universe. That that's a yeah. weekend for mom, dad. Yeah, complete brother. planet. Half his planet. Half brother. Yeah, that's it. Oh, gone. But now and his teammates are gone as well. Yeah, I mean, I, I miss Heimdall, man. I miss Heimdall. I think it yeah, just yeah, yeah. come back, man. No, I don't need to come back. No, no, I, w- I would like him to come. No, not not the character of Heimdall, but him as like he should be like a. a like a voice actor for like a CGI character. So oh, I see what you mean. I yeah, like yeah, it, I like yeah. him as a person. I don't like the fact that they killed off so many like big, big names very early. Or well, not early, I guess. It was like... Yeah, it's the end game, man. It's, the, it's, on, it's come to an end. Oh, that was, I was in Finchwell, actually. But, uh, yeah, yeah, sorry. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> fucking... Yeah, so, yeah. Toonie, Toonie Stork. <laughs> when we first play, yeah? Yeah. We can work this time. It's a god bard. And after all this that, Milne, Milne, he reclaimed his title. <laughs> The one and only Thor. Oh, spoke too soon. Jane? What's your thoughts on that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> off camera, bro, off camera, bro, off camera. <laughs> bro, on a G thing? She's nice. Boy. No, she's not even nice. And she's wham she as well. She seems one of those like, like tough women, like, super smart as well. I mean, she off, is. I mean, off oh, cam. Yeah, no, she's dumb as hell. But <laughs> <laughs> Love playing. I don't I'm know. about to say, how the hell do you know that? <laughs> nah. Your inside information. Inside information. <laughs> exclusive, exclusive, exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. She's, obviously, her character is someone that's quite... She's like she's up for um, a Nobel, Nobel Prize Prize, isn't it? In the, is it? In the movie, yeah. In the movie? Oh. Not the actual fucking the character. Same, Bro, I'm talking about the actual actor, oh. man. No, the character, sorry. In the movie? Yeah. So, not, in this not, film. Um, um, Jane Foster was going up... So, in... in, in um, Oh, oh, Age of Ultron. Oh, Age of Ultron? Yeah, really? so in Age of... No, no, no. So, four was... No, no, that party scene. In yeah, the beginning? Yeah, 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 so yeah. Where um, Tony's trying to big up Pepper and Thor's trying to big up Jane Foster on a yeah. testosterone, test- testosterone team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he said, yeah, she's even a thing of her being winning a Nobel Peace Prize, whatever. So, so obviously, the character is very, very smart in terms yeah. of astrology and stuff like that. And now she's wham and laying it a ras, yeah. bro. God damn. Do you have any theories on how she got her powers? I mean, I'm familiar with the comic book story. Whether they adapt it is a bit is, is, is up for interpretation, I guess. Do you want them to adapt the film comics, or just do they all not speak? Yeah, to I think it? I think the comics has a really interesting. I think we'll, I'll avoid saying it for spoiler reasons, but yeah. I think they, they the comics actually like, um, explores a very interesting uh, storyline, a very interesting yeah. kind of like oh, like what would you do in a situation? I watched a video recently on Screen Crush's channel where they talk about the question of the, st- of the video was, "Are superheroes happy?" Okay, and they talk about how. You either choose a life of either die a hero or ling- lo- live long enough to see yourself become the villain. Yeah, villains are happy until they lose. Yeah, villains are happy until they lose, but hero- heroes are hap- are hap- sad until they win. Because yeah. when they win, and that, that lasts is only a short period of time because there's no villain coming out of the woodworks. You know what I'm saying so. Like, are superheroes happy? You, you have these. Ama- I've always wanted to be Spider Man as a kid. I always wanted to have that power of like all that shit. But when you grow up, you realize that brothers. Bro, no one knows who Peter Parker is in that world. And he's world. poor. Broke as hell. He makes no money. Like, 
And because he can't even keep a job because he has to sacrifice yeah. his his life. Bro. And I would have would have beaten my identity, man. Like, Serious? Yeah, man. It's, like, no, 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 but he, even then, but even then, like, bro, like Doctor Strange and happy. Doctor Strange and happy. Everyone knows who he is, but he's not happy because yeah. he can't. He can't have any. He can't love. Have a relationship. Okay, relationship, and he's constantly yeah. leaving his his world, his his, his his dimension, his universe constantly. Yeah, we need to touch. We need to touch on the the sadness of a hero. Bro, they're not happy, man. Yeah, it's fucked. I said, do you think? Do you think? <laughs> no, because like, yeah, when I man. say, do you think Marvel ever like touch on that? They've been touching on that shit, but I feel like they just <clears throat> dab on it. No, they get. I think they get a heavily touch on it in the Spider-Man trilogy that's coming up. Because have you have you played um the Spider-Man PS4 game? I played bits of it. I haven't played it completely. Fucking virgin, bro. Yeah. Listen, wow. <laughs> man's gonna be a virgin for not playing video games. <laughs> Who would have thought? Man, it it would get like how this. the world has changed in these past few years. Um. <laughs> If you play that game, I think the the next trilogy will be heavily, um, what's the word? It 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 will be very similar to that game. If you if you play mm. the game and you you have you, you understand the, the storyline, you really that's one of the best uh, Spider Man stories okay. written today, in yeah. video form, I guess. Okay. If you play like you actually really enjoy it, and I think that's that 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 is around his um, I think his post college life, so it's around yeah. like his 21, 22, 23 year old um is uh, that age range. Yeah. Um. And it just explores how what life is like as a superhero. What do you have to sacrifice? What do you have to um yeah. give up to be to have great power and great responsibility? You know. Yeah. Okay. It is um is a difficult lifestyle to live, man. For sure. Um. Shit. It's a bit sad. <laughs> no, it, it actually is. Oh, my. The old ex girlfriend. What's it been like? Three, four years. Eight years. So, so have you, do you do you notice that thing? No, it's been three, four years. For her? Yeah. But for him, it's been eight years. Do the maths. Oh, but didn't she get... Do you think she got the... Um, what's she, it called? She got the, the blimp? No, the blimp is when they come back. She got dusted, didn't it? Oh, dusted. Okay. So for her, it was three years. But his, him, it was eight years. And he, plus, because he was depressed for so long, he actually counted the days. Yeah. Bro, his maths is eight years. That was like a weekend for my man. Yeah. Let's be honest. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah, that, that, these little things here and there that they do, like, she felt like three, four years. For him, it was eight years. Yeah. Because, like, these little things, like, they pop like, they just, you know what I'm saying? They just throw trying in. to make it more sense because, of course, she dropped out from the Marvel Universe and now she jumped back in. You know, the, her scenes in um, Endgame were <laughs> recycled oh. footage from. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, yeah. yeah <laughs> the yeah, recycled yeah. footage from Fippin. Yeah, yeah. um, what's it? Dark World. That's funny. But I think she was already was signed up to do this for film. No, she wasn't. Really? Because she came to the red carpet for, for Endgame. Yeah, but um, when Tiki Watiti, he, when he. <laughs> <laughs> when he um sorry um no so he you know losing red carpet it was the comic con no comic con yeah San Diego comic con like yeah. she came through with the hammer and she's like yeah I'm gonna be in E four but the script the concept was already written before yeah. that yeah and because she saw because that that San Diego thing was really was uh, I think it happened when did it happen I think was it before or after Infinity War I'm pretty sure it was after Infinity War um, I'm not sure about the timeline on that but regardless like it wasn't often she till she saw Ragnarok that she said there are like I want to be in the next one. Because yeah. by the time they finished, the, they released Ragnarok, they're really starting on the next one. They didn't know what's going to happen in Endgame. You know how much source you have to make a film like that and have like two big actors say, yo, I want to be in the next one? He's Bro. doing bits, you know. I think w- one day we're going to do like a full episode on directors and he needs to be one of them. That we bring out all your flipping hard drives. A deep dive. A deep dive. <laughs> 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 you know, an entire team, no fucking you know, like, that's, a, that's like an inside, inside joke, bro. Like, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> this, this trailer, man. After six days, we give or take. My, um, sensing feelings. Well, you're right. The only ones who gods care about... Read the colors. ...is themselves. So this is my vow. All gods will die. I just want to say that was very, very impressive what you did back there. It's just my first bad guy. What's the colors when they Never forget you first. Yeah. You are not like the other gods that have killed. Because I have something worth fighting for. Yeah. Bro, how are you not excited for this you movie, bro? That's such I a. Sam, you started building up. Bro, watching this. How you no, got, I, no, it is. I, I think I've, I've said this countless times. Maybe I've said this off camera, so people, people don't have like a record of me saying this. But I'm just 
I just know n- normally with Marvel, they always make stuff a joke thing. Make it very comical, which I'm okay with jokes here and How there. How can you say that? I don't, want it, I don't want it to be a constant film where there's constant jokes. So I, I, it's not so much that I'm, I'm not excited. I'm scared that it's going to be like a One joke second, film. sorry, before you... Have you so you've seen the, 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 the shows that's come out recently, right? The TV shows, the Marvel yeah. TV shows. Yeah. Have you not seen Wanda being depressed out of her fucking mind? Have you not seen when Bucky had his thing taken out of him? Did you not see that scene? Yeah. Have you not but, seen but I'm, Loki I'm, I'm watch himself to, die? to Van Der Rock. Hopefully I said Ragnarok. that right. Yeah. But even then, Hella was, she it, was badass. She didn't make no, there was no jokes. It was jokes. funny as hell. It was too, it was too funny, man. No, but that was never meant. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even like how they had Hulk behave at certain scenes as well. That was a really nice version of the Hulk. I, I really, I really yeah. enjoyed looking at the, what like, when it's in that version of Hulk. I like, so I like a gritty Hulk. That's why I love like a, a dark side of Hulk. Uh, apparently like that fucking brother. So you, you hate, um, you hate um, Professor Hulk. Yeah. You don't like him? You know what's interesting? Have you seen the the, the She Hulk trailer? No. Let's watch that as one of these things. I actually yeah. want to watch it. Yeah. yeah. No, but let me, let me say this thing when we get the She Hulk trailer. Not that one. Cool. Um, but yeah, like I said, this watching this again, watching I've watched the trailer before. Watching it again, the excitement's going up mainly because the Christian Bell. Yeah, he's, I like yeah, when he, when, he, when I saw him in the scene again. Mm. He's like, oh, God's must die. <laughs> he's so white. <laughs> <laughs> and like the way this guy's body fluctuates. Oh, he is being <laughs> so hell and bad. So, like. How? Bro, how did he just do he this? He went to from the. Have you seen when he did? He, I think he did um, oh, American Hustle, it? It was American Hustle. Wham. He gained weight. And there was Wham. another film where he played like um someone in someone. It was like a politics film. I can't remember the film. But you were so fucked up as well. He gained weight for that as well. Yeah, but listen, look, I don't know why he does it because you've seen Ragnarok. You've seen when he was wham. Chris Hemsworth was never was never gonna get wham like that. Like he was never gonna get fat like that. Mm. So he obviously had to do with prosthetics, and it looked real as hell. Yeah. So why? This guy is, is a method actor. Like he actually m- becomes the person. Yeah, I respect it. I respect he it becomes, heavily because you feel like he has to. He needs to feel. Yeah. That. So now think about Kristen Bell using his method acting to become a god. And that's why the excitement turned into fear because I just don't want him to waste. I don't want him to waste that. This talent. guy does not listen. This don't guy waste has, that talent. This guy has done one superhero trilogy. Yeah. And that's it so far. Yeah. So films come back. Yes, I, I get you. And the fact that he's comm- like he's. He, Oh, he watched Ragnarok. He liked it. When what joke? What joke chair has he ever been in? Be honest. Even the joke. Yeah, he hasn't been in. Jo- I'm, I'm just talking about Marvel as a whole. Yeah, but I'm saying when what, they take like, that like, yeah, actors, I feel like they're wasted at times. No, but that's the thing because you're you're not you're not scared of the fact that there's gonna be jokes in the movie. You're scared of the fact that they're gonna be jokes in the serious moments. Yeah, so serious moments are gonna that's, be around Kristen exactly, Bell. That's exactly what I'm. So if Kristen Bell doesn't like a scene, that like, joke, he's I'm, gonna I'm say. I'm so it. serious. I feel like there's gonna be a scene where it's gonna be bare serious. La, 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 there, la, la, yeah. And he's there, and then he's saying he's more log where he's like, I'm gonna kill all the gods, and then for the farts. I'm like, why the fuck are you fighting? Oh, <laughs> he just like, oh, pardon me. <laughs> like, you know how Ford was like, oh, sorry. <laughs> he just grabs a beer, like, oh. <laughs> you know, you know, remember that scene in, um, in Ragnarok where he's like, uh, fucking Serta is monologuing. He's yeah. like, one second, let me turn back around because he's spinning in that chain. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I'm actually doing this. Still, yeah, that's that, fine. That, I, I those that. moments are, are cool, but for certain times, like, sometimes yeah. I just want it to be serious. Especially yeah. if I feel like if this is going to be the last four film. Probably will be. I reckon he'll get serious after this. Really? Oh, I'm, big I'm, big question. I feel like we just need him to... Like, the he's whole not going to die. He's, like, he's this a god is, of thunder. This is, the pop, this is the perfect villain for him to end off of. A villain that kills gods. Yeah. I don't think... Do you think Christian's going to die in this one? I don't think he's going to die, but I think they need to close his story. He still needs. No, to I'm end. saying, do you think um the God Butcher is gonna die in this one? Yeah, Christian, Bell. Christian Bell's gonna do another fucking film. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, oh, yeah, like maybe five Christian years. Christian Bell's gonna be like, yeah, let me, I'm gonna do it, but I want to do it, but I want to do one. I'm gonna. No, no, dude, on I, I, reckon, I think, I think, depending on how, we, I think he will survive in this one, and if it wasn't a joke thing and people receive it well, he'll probably come back. Maybe not like in the next three years. Maybe yeah. in the next 10, 15 years, where like, yeah. oh shit, he's back, that kind of thing. Question: Do you think? Answer. This will be. Did you say, <laughs> so silly. Do you this think this will be one of the top Marvel villains? Ooh. From from my past, I realized Marvel was not that great at yeah, showcasing they, they, villains. Do villains. you think this villain will be a difference for them? <clears throat> You're saying like on the on the level of Killmonger. Yeah, the, the uh, biggest one we Loki. have is, is is Thanos to me, and and Loki yeah. Loki's up there. Killmonger is definitely up there as well. But yeah, they, they killed him. Up up. I'm not too fan of, of Michael B. Jordan as an actor. But you like the act, the act, the character, and the character I like philosophies. I like, I like, yeah. yeah, don't yeah, don't yeah. listen. This is what they fucked up about <laughs> Winter Soldier. Yeah. Falcon and Winter Soldier. They always don't. don't Winter Soldier was such a good film, by the way. 
Huh? Oh, oh no, 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 I'm, I'm sorry. Not Marvel, I'm, I'm talking about um, Falcon with sort of the, the show. Oh, okay. They they keep like putting that. What's it? I think saying Russell. What's his name? Russell. The John Walker's character, uh, the actor that plays John Walker. Oh, fake f- Captain Fake America. Oh, I don't know. Black in America. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've seen that. Black in <laughs> America. Yeah. <laughs> but um, um, Wyatt Russell, that's the guy. He he played um U.S. agent or, or John Walker. Yeah. And they keep because he took up. He tried. He obviously took up the mantle of Captain America. People started attacking the actor as an individual. Yeah. That's what you're yeah. doing with Michael B. Jordan. No, I just saying, thought fuck the actor no, cause, like, and the character as a result of that. In no. this is a, this is a whole other story. But in Black Panther, like Killmonger, like Bill. Uh, Michael Jordan, I feel like he didn't do like a, a great job. I think he did an amazing job. I think like he had sick one liners, but if you watch back again, I know the mer- new movie was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I definitely think, no, it's mad because my brother yeah. actually my my brother called it. He's like Black Panther's a shit movie. Yeah, like, right, like, shut the fuck up. But then I watched it again recently. Yeah, it's a terrible movie. Not a good movie. It was obviously yeah, it's, it's one of those films like it's an old black, yeah, black cast, power. So fuck yeah, yeah. And he, I'm like, yeah, yeah. I get that part. But then he's <laughs> like, the movie's yeah, shit. Like, let's it's be, not, it's look, not a good film. It's not yeah, it's 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 not terrible. It's like, but do do you think this villain will be? This so yeah, so this one definitely. Yeah. Mm, I don't wanna, I don't put my hopes too high, man. Because they got a really good actor. Very, very, very and good. And that's actor. that's goes back to my fear. Mm. <laughs> Are they gonna waste it? Yeah. That's yeah. my only fear. Are they gonna waste a good actor? It's simply not possible. Why not you? Because I'm I'm assuming, I'm hoping he has you know how Thanos has those one liners that that bang yeah, yeah, yeah. that we used to this day. They all definitely have well in, in I this feel like movie, he has to have. Do you think this one liner they said all gods will die? Do you think that's his best line in the movie? No. I'm, I'm hoping. And if I'm it isn't, then that was a more. bad boy line. Yeah. And the way he said it, is, his delivery as well, yeah. is like, bro, all I, d- I didn't know much too much about this this villain here. I'm, I'm yeah. assuming you probably probably do. I'm so I did a little, little research. Obviously, um, the know, whole so premise is that his parents dies. Yeah, and God didn't, didn't save him. Didn't save him. So if they touch on that, the, th- the whole problem I have with Marvel with villains, they don't really touch on the, the, but the background no, no, that's of, the, thing, of the villain. But the thing that I love about it is the fact that they don't touch on the villain's backstory in the move in the comics, but they touch on the villain's backstory relevant to the world they live in. Yeah. So they they they. This is the thing, yeah, and and it, it did upset me for a long time, so I like I embraced it. These 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 producers and whatever they don't, they the comics the source material mm. is source material. It's yeah. it's the motivation for a new story in the new universe. The yeah. fact of the matter is, they can just bring another character and completely rewrite his entire backstory. Yeah. Doesn't even fucking matter because this is a completely different universe. The fact what they're doing is they're taking inspiration from they're taking the character and taking inspiration from the comics and, and then adapting yeah. it to this specific world. Yeah, it's that's why that's what we always say. Like it's inspired by the comic book character. It's inspired. Or, like, it's, not, it's not. It's not from the comic book character. It's not even adapted. It's inspired. It can't yeah. be adapted. If it's adapted, it's, it's, yeah. it's just taken so it's from the page. To the, I'm saying so. So, so, be yeah. so the thing and the thing is we don't. Could the comics aren't the Bible, bro. You feel me? It the, doesn't the, have to be. That's the thing. Yeah, the, no, no, the comics ain't like this thing where you c- it's, it's, it's like perfection a, and yeah, there's yeah. some shit comics, bro. I can tell you firsthand there's some shit comics. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's what you mean. For, us, yeah. um, for, for them to like say, oh, you're, no, you're not loyal to the comics. The comics were shit. The movie was good. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, man. I'd be yeah. happy that we got something better than what's on, on the pages, isn't it? Yeah. So the idea is, the fact of the matter is, 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 is creativity is subjective. Yeah. And some people love the comics and others like the movie. It doesn't yeah. fucking matter. It's yeah. creativity. We can't say... There is not a unanimous decision or, or opinion on creativity. There's a majority sometimes, yeah. but, so, but there's not a <laughs> unanimous. You know? <laughs> there's not a unanimous opinion on creativity. Yeah, not everyone loves the comic books. Not everyone loves the movies. Yeah. But they tried. Yeah. That's why I always respect filmmakers and I respect man Star Wars. I respect <laughs> filmmakers. <laughs> fuck yeah. Brian Johnson. Yeah. No, it's right. No, fuck. What's that? Uh, Abraham. What's Abraham. his name? No, sorry, who? The guy that directed um, the, the Rise of Skywalker. Thank Abraham. J.J. Abrams. J.J. Yeah. Abrams. Yeah, yeah. Ryan, Ryan Johnson, he's the cool guy. Yeah. Abrams is a dickhead. But then again, I don't know them. So I, 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 I have completely wrong. <laughs> yeah. But not yet. The, the, this this need for the source material to be adapted word for word. Like even that, that shot of um that, that dinosaur looking god that died and they obviously... Um, yeah, that was a beautiful that's, shot. That's, that's, that, that was from... The, that's like pre- pixel for pixel. Oh, from the comics. From it? Minus Korg. It was pixel for pixel, wasn't it? Yeah. That's 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 um that's basically them saying thank you for creating this thing. Now let's kind of utilize this and make this like a spectacle because we never got to see this thing in a big screen. We got to see it in a little little, little page, isn't it? Yeah. So these things is going above and beyond. Like even adapting the character and utilizing some of their, some of their backstory is, is going above and beyond. Yeah. But all they can do really is just take what they can from the comics and but, try to make but it in better. terms of the film, it has to be somewhat different because to interpret certain stuff in the comics just won't work. So they have to. 
And there's an of opportunity course. to make a better story for a character. Yeah, exactly. Bro, you think you were going to get No Way Home in a comic? It's impossible. Yeah. I don't know. If, I don't know. We kind of changed topic just just a minute ago, but I don't know if you um you confirmed or not. Do you think the villain? Yeah, yeah, no, no. I said yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. You can, they can't be, waste it. It's gonna be a top a top villain then. So your 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 excitement from the beginning was always up then. So you're definitely. No, no my excitement was here, and then I watched the trailers, and then it was up here. Yeah. And the thing is, yeah, this is what I love about Marvel, yeah, especially that Taiko T and um uh, James James Gunn. So, I never, so music has never been a thing I grew up with in it. So yeah. I didn't listen to music until I was like twelve. Yeah. Um. So these tracks that they're playing now, I'm starting to just put them to my playlist and listen yeah. to them regularly. Sweet Child of Mine was the biggest, one of the biggest ones. I even got the fucking Guardians of the Galaxy um, album. You know, Guardians of the Galaxy is one of those films that had like really great music. Yeah, and I got it downloaded on my phone. Like, yeah. I actually listen to the, the, the music from it regularly. Yeah. Um. So James Gunn's really good at that. He done it. He done a lot with Peacemaker, Peacemaker as well. Yeah. yeah. And and Suicide Squad. Yeah, he's really good at um, the music. That, that, I mean, that's his, so he he actually picks out the playlist before he writes the movie. Yeah, I I can see it. It's amazing. I can it's, see it. I can see him listening to certain songs and go. I can already vision it, yeah, scene yeah. for this, and then imp- implementing it into an actual film. That's his like direction style. Really, that's really. Dope. That's it. Um, but now, so, so the thing is, the thing that I hate is the fact that I do not know these these songs before watching these trailers. Yeah. Like, let's say, for example, Miss Marvel. Yeah. What was the track they used for Miss Marvel? The the um blinding lights by uh, the weekend. Oh it? yes, yes. So yes, the yes, fact yeah, that yeah. I knew that song, it yeah. helped enhance my experience. Yeah. But when I don't know the song, my experience isn't as enhanced. Now this this track, I don't know for a fact they're gonna use it in the movie. Yeah. I've been listening to it regularly. I've been singing it. You see, if you look in the security cameras, I've been singing it with my chest up high. Like I love this <laughs> yeah. track. Yeah. Um. So now that when it comes to the movie, my enha- experience is enhanced because I know the track. Yeah. Whereas if I don't know the track, so what, what they've allowed me to do is they allowed me to explore very old music that actually fucking bang. Like the other one is um from Moon Knight, Man Without Love. Every yeah. day I wake up, then I start to break up. In Moonlight. Moon- oh, yes, Moonlight. yes, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, when, yeah. I, when I first heard it in episode one, I'm like, oh, that's a banger still. Yeah, I downloaded nice. it, I started listening to it regularly. Yeah. It reappeared in the last episode. I'm like, yeah, and that's my tune. Like, Even certain songs I already know of that they use. Like they use, they use Day and Night from Kid Cudi. Yeah, Moonlight yeah, yeah. As well. yeah. That, like, yeah, we're gonna do like a separate episode talking about music, yeah, yeah, but the power yeah. of music in like TV shows and movies is so strong that like, one it of them capitalized the whole scene. And and and, and, and like I said, it enhances experience. Yeah, one of the things that Jeremy Johns did um with one of the movies where what he did he got um he listened to the soundtrack for the movie before going into the cinemas because they released the soundtrack early before they move, released the movie yeah. or same day or whatever. So we what 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 he would do is on his way to work or whatever he would play the soundtrack as. On loop in it so that you can kind of get familiar with the soundtrack yeah so that when you hear it in the thing because if you're watching interstellar for the first time and you didn't know that famous hans in the track yeah it's just it's just background noise yeah, yeah but yeah. when you know the track your experience is enhanced significantly especially when you've got like if you've got like surround sound or headphones on whatever. it takes you back to a certain time when you listen to it um, that, there's that as well but the familiarity of a track enhances the experience so when they use music like this obviously yeah like some people don't like the idea that like, i think it was what movie was it i think it was um Suicide Squad, the first one, yeah. they used a lot of pop, pop culture music. Yeah. And, I mean, in that case, it was a bit shit because they used it. was it. shit because they're using, like, current songs. Yeah. They're, like, they made an uh, album. Yeah, yeah. So they're using very, that like, new, bad, you know? It was, it was a good, they so had so one so song with, um, a bad boy track. Oh, I can't remember what song it is. I think it was Imagine Dragons was on one song. I that, touch you. Yeah, I think it was that. That song was cold. That, that song was cold. It was cold. So, uh, so enhancing that, that these movies that, that, that surround, uh, surrounded by music, that these um, movies that surround by music, that these um, movies that surround by music, they, like I said, they would always enhance the thing. So next time, if they release the soundtrack for this movie early, I'm gonna listen to it. I'm on pretty sure they will. The thing is, I'm gonna watch like this over and over. Just looking at like, right now, it reports that the the title. Yeah. And like you can tell, this is like an eighties type of like. Yeah. It was always an eighties you know, like, yeah. type of vibe going on right now. Um, I'll say um, last question I wanted to ask in terms of this film is: Do you think this film is gonna change the Marvel universe in a in an extreme way, or do you think it's just it's kind of like a throwaway film? In I think you'll do it in one. I think. I think the thing the movie itself won't do anything. Yeah. I think the pr- post credit scene has potential. Assuming four survives, mm. Loki. Yeah. Loki. I, I think right now they're just trying to build the new Avengers right yeah, now. Yeah, but I'm saying I'm saying Loki, bro. Okay. Post credit scene. I think the movie itself won't do anything significant. Obviously, it would Ooh. introduce Jane Jane Foster. It would Ooh. introduce it would introduce Valkyrie. You think that can happen? Loki. Loki now has um he he can go to any universe he wants. He's fucking well, America Chavez. Well, to be fair, the universe that he, he that four was in, he's dead in it. So I guess he can go into that universe. Yeah, can, no, no, he, he, no. He 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 is America Chavez, bro. Basically, really? like he has her powers. He can go to. He can visit wherever you know. But I mean, apparently, the rule no, was you can't go to a universe that you're already in for no, too long because no. then no, no, it, it, it creates um 
Paradox are saying. No, no, you're not paradox. So it creates a, a, a timeline, extra timeline, and then that leads to um. No, I thought it's incursion. Like the, the thing. The inc- that's that's, that's, that's an incursion. So it yeah. creates an, a, a separate timeline, and then in turn that does sometimes create an incursion, which is where two two worlds collide. Yeah. Or two universes collide. Um, but I'm I'm saying he has the um, that machine, the tempad. Yeah. Which obviously allows you to enter different universes or whatever. Yeah. If he has access to that, he can go say hi. That like, he can go like. Bust a one cover. Like I would be happy on a proper G thing. I'd be happy if the post credit scene was a one minute conversation between Lo- uh, Thor and Loki, just just get to, just to catch up. That'd be interesting. Because he's dealing with a, 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 a Loki that's like he's grown now. Yeah, but he's he also see he's seen what the other version of himself has experienced. Yeah, which is Thor's Loki. He knows what he has yeah, experienced. You saw how he died. Imagine everything. having to explain that to him. Yeah. Oh, by the way, I'm not Loki from you. I mean, to be fair, Thor is already familiar. So just somewhat to the degree yeah. of different universes because he did a time travel thing, right? Yeah. Um, but no, actually, I think he doesn't. Unless Bruce Banner explains him, he probably doesn't. But having to explain, oh yeah, I'm not the Loki you're familiar with. I'm a different Loki from a different universe. Yeah. I know what your Loki went through. I have another experience. By the way, shit's about to go fucking down. Yeah. If you ever hear about other guy called Re- um uh, Franklin Richards or Kang. Fucking shoot him in the head before it yeah. goes completely left. I don't know if we're gonna get well that. I think yeah, probably not. But the like post credit scene, probably just see them like see each other. If we see them, if we see Loki, yeah, that'd be really, really nice, man. Because yeah. yeah, there was yeah, one yeah. more question on the arcs. I, was, I said that was gonna be the last question, yeah, exactly, but, exactly. but I remember before we were shooting. I think it was before we were shooting. <clears throat> and we touched on the the running time for for this the film. Time, yeah. So I just want to touch on that real quickly. One fifty nine. Yeah. So it's under two hours. This is probably by the, a the minute, lowest, but yeah. It's the one, it's one there was a chart. I think I don't think I posted on the Instagram page yet, but. There was a chart that shows all the all the Marvel films. Mm. This one by the by the running time, and shorter since like, twenty eighteen, yeah, like close to like probably like five other films. It's about probably just yeah. five. No, films. no, it's, it said on the on the post uh, outtake pod on Instagram. Yeah, come on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it said um on on the thing you shared. It said it was the shortest movie since twenty eighteen. Yeah. Um, what movies came out in twenty eighteen? Yeah, I can't I can't trace that back, but. There, there was another post also put out. No, there. Oh, 22 was Ragnarok. Yeah, the ones that's. No, Ragnarok is 17. It's above. No, Infinity War, Infinity War, Black Panther, and. No, it's um, crazy, like. Captain Marvel was. Films 22. like Iron Man is mm. longer, than this, longer than this film. Yeah, but Iron Man, Iron Man had Iron a purpose. Man's longer than this film. I yeah, think the only one that's. From what I can recall, I probably can find it on my phone, but I'll be teaching. I, I don't think runtime is, is that much of a. Because. A big like, deal. Yeah, I don't think it's. it's, if, I think if, it's if pacing well, is the problem. What I was saying outside of. um Before we was recording is. We're gonna f- we're gonna feel that it's sure. Maybe if the pacing. No, I think we only feel it if the pacing is done wrong. The pacing. Doctor Strange's pacing is, was fucked. Yeah. Shit, was shit. But the thing is, which is good. Actually, I don't, I don't know. You know, because before, like, especially from watching the trailer, he was going to different planets. So we're gonna feel mm. the running time because he's gonna bounce from different locations. Oh, this if is why. If it's only in one location, then it will it will be easy just in, like an mm. hour and so. This is why I hate this podcast, you know. <laughs> you know, I hate this podcast because I'm I yeah. have I have so much information prior to watching the movie that it ruins my experience. <laughs> Don't you think? It's mad, isn't it? Like you have so much. I know the runtime. I know the actor. I know why the actor is in the movie. I know he had a conversation. I was there when the conversation happened. Yeah. Like, I know so much information going to the movie. Yeah, it just ruins my experience. Nah, it won't ruin the sense for me to be fair. Serious. I still enjoy. You it. don't think about the runtime. You don't like. You don't get to, like. You don't but think. But like about, you oh, said, the pace. But I'm the only thing if is, the pacing if, it is shit, if it goes to different planets, it's hard to have pace. To no, but I'm saying if the pacing it. starts feeling shit, you're not going to think about it. For, oh, yeah, it's fine because it's one hour. That. No, because you don't want to think about that shit. But I don't fair, want to think about that shit. If it's a fucking brilliant film for one hour or two, whoever yeah. it is, then I won't give a fuck. I mean, two hours is not that bad of a... I've I mean, seen good movies. Yeah. Fair, back in the day, films were like... Oh, I said, I said back in the day. How old are you? But like, films <laughs> were like an hour and a half. That, yeah, was, no, yeah. that was like the regular. Yeah. So no, this not, film not, is like an hour. But the thing is, it's not... 40 it's, or 50 minutes. Yeah, but back in the day, the films were an hour and a half because that was the attention span of those people. It was adapted to the times. Whereas our attention span is a lot. You know what I'm saying? So our, our team... We consume stuff a lot. Part, you know what I'm saying? We need to be part of experience for a lot longer for us to actually feel the movie. Listen. As long as they get straight to the point. Yeah, yeah. I mean, obviously, don't waste no time. The, the, I mean, I'm seeing trailers of him training. Just hope that's a quick montage. Yeah, no, I get out the way. Yeah, he's montage. back into his shit. And you know, then... he's bigger. I've heard he's bigger than he was in Ragnarok. Yeah, Ragnarok, he was fucking big, bro. Yeah, he's like, doing. Because it makes thing. sense. Because if you if you look figure about like scientifically, if you have a lot of fat, you turn the fat into muscle. You tend to be like a lot. You get bulky, yeah. So it makes a lot of sense. But yeah. boy, that center thing. You know about center? No. You know about center? No. 
Uh, oh, the app that he yeah, has. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You've been utilizing that shit for yeah. a minute. Can't lie. Well, we... <laughs> <laughs> and then you got. Um... Well, even Thing was doing her thing. Um, Natalie Portman. Yeah, she's wham as well. She's wham as well. She's a one bicep right here. Now, you know what I'm saying? Oh, that, 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 that turned me on still. The little muscle she got there. You seen, seen that video when the guy, the guy lifts the girl, lifts up the guy. She's gonna let that marinate for a minute. <laughs> she can that to me, boy. We're going, we're going over time. Um, we ain't gonna do this no time, man. Wait, you, you, you read it after this. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was gonna say the last thought on this film before we move on to. You. I, I don't even think Excellent. about this film. I think about another film. <laughs> I want to see this motherfucker, man. I, mean, I think that film's gonna be cold, but it's gonna come out this year. Let's, let's, let's just wrap up this film. No, it's same actor accounts. <laughs> <laughs> they wrap this film. I'm talking about extraction so, too, by any, the way. Any last thoughts do you have I have on this? So you're looking forward to it and you and you think it's gonna be sick. Don't fuck up. Bro, extraction two is written by Joe Russo. Yeah, they did, they did the first one as well. Yeah. It makes sense. That's how I watched it. They produced it and they and they directed it. Yeah, that's how I watched it to be fair. Um no, last thoughts on this film, press play. Let's see who you are. So when you finish this, no, <laughs> no, no, bro. Yes, guys. And flip. Oh, you flip too hard, damn it! Oh, look at what I mean. You know, a lot of people commenting about this. Eventually, grape. No, that's just a joke. Apparently, for split, I'm panny. Um, Zeus is he Zeus in it? Zeus is must be like this. And flip. Ignore this part. Yeah. Look at this part. Look at the back muscle. No. It's the back fucking back piece part. Listen. <laughs> Pay attention to this part of his body. Yeah. What's that? You're trying to say like the whole... What do you mean? Loki. Really? What do you he mean? Has, he has a Loki tattoo in his back for his, uh, his horns. I don't see a Loki tattoo on his Bro, back. Bro, the horns. You don't see the horns? No. Why the fuck you got his brother tattooed on his back? No, his brother is a, is a, is a, is a, is a, is a flipping, um, what's the word? What, like a bird? A tribute. Yeah, it's a tribute. a tribute. Yeah, bro. Let me, let me show you something. One second. Oh, because he died. Yeah. No fucking way. Also, you fucking put a tattoo on his back. <laughs> That's what I was, I was thinking. Why the fuck he has a tattoo on his back? Uh, yeah, follow him in front of Hey, Yeah, look. Oh, look. That's just, that's Loki's thing. Oh, sick. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Hey. Not many people know that. That's really, really. I mean, it's not in fine detail. Like at first, yeah, I thought it was his hair that mm. was hanging, hanging down. But yeah. Yo, who do? Who, do you know how unbreakable Asgardian skin is? <laughs> how do you tattoo an Asgardian skin? Have you yeah, seen um? Have you seen uh, What's it called Luke Cage? Yeah, yeah. You know how they try to inject something yeah, in it, yeah, it wouldn't and work. And just snapped straight away. I'm sure what? they got certain like material, or probably like even magic they used to on him. And it's just, it's I, I want to see him. Oh, you flip too hard, damn it! Oh, okay. This is an IPS fight. Then eventually, grape. Yeah, they're so long. You know, I always feel about how did actors feel like. like no, no. Male, male actors, by the way. Mm. How did they feel just like they had to just show their abs? Same way women feel about. I mean, to be fair, men, men don't care about it as much. Bro, any, any but bisexual. Men go for it as well. One second, one second, any bisexual person is going to have an orgasm from that scene. Yeah, but you know that scene you was there for everyone half naked. It was there for sex appeal. That, that scene no, 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 no. I'm saying appeal. as a if you're a bisexual, you have four half naked and Natalie Portman and uh, Tessa Thompson all looking 10-10. Ten, ten. Bro, oh, bro, all three of them. If you're bi, you're... Oh, bro. That scene's going to be insane. I mean, if you're bi or straight, like you pick and choose which one. You... No, if you're bi, you like both, no? Yeah, but if you're straight, you just focus on the women. Yeah, but then both. imagine having an overload of all everything, everything you love is right there. <laughs> he said it. <laughs> what he's saying is yeah. it's a, a, mm. a bisexual it's all, all you can eat <laughs> buffet <laughs> ba, ba, bisexual buffet yeah BB <laughs> July the 8th this film comes out um, oh shit it is yeah, I'm looking forward oh, to it soon. that's soon ne- m- like I'm less than a month I'm, looking, I'm gonna watch it in the cinema man yeah, ma- yeah, yeah. I'm down you saying you're trying to go together you know I've been trying to you're hopping I'm down still let's go together come yeah, I'm down we still we hold hands in that what <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, I, was, I, think, Trust I think first part I was like, I'm not watching normal Marvel stuff. Yeah, I'm you not was, telling man. this. But you're watching Miss Marvel. I watched Miss Marvel. <laughs> you can't leave, bro. To go, you like this. I'm in. You're in chains. I'm in the you're, story. You're like, in. I'm in. I have to, be, I have to keep kept bro, on the loop. You know, is they're doing stuff where it's like it's still Disney Marvel, but they're yeah. getting, they're adding little sauce to even Miss Marvel's little. 
changing like the way they film it. The, the yeah, and that, that, yeah, it's really, really beautiful. Fight the touching on, on a Muslim person as well, touching her back. I, that, that's fucking. That's so stupid, bro. The whole Muslim, it, n- not the whole Muslim thing. I'm saying yeah. uh, some of the scenes is fucked up. Man. Like one, one obviously I grew up in a Muslim background. And I'm looking at like well, this is bullshit. Second thing, yeah. obviously music is not is not a thing that's that's allowed in in religion. Yeah, I gotta see a music scene and straight after that they pray. <laughs> 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 what the fuck is this? <laughs> I mean, it's the bro, it's like, still, shit. Still Hollywood. Yeah, yeah bro, <laughs> yeah, like, as mean, much as they try to, they're trying, but they're trying. It's still Hollywood. They're trying. Man. They're trying. Um, I mean, well, yeah, what can I say, man? This is close and thoughts in this. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm ready to see it. I just hope they just don't do my 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 dog. My Christianity, my Christianity bal, 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 family. <laughs> yeah, just don't do it wrong, man. Let, let him do what he does best, man. All gods will die, man. Yeah. Keep that energy. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Keep that energy. Even that face. You know that face they made. No fighting. No fighting. No I characters. Fight. Yeah. And had thing. Had, oh, I'm going to put this in the in YouTube uh, video. I want to see the face. Where's that face that you, you made? Who's the, who's that guy? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where, is he? Where is he? There he is. Oh, t- Tiki with Tiki. This guy here. He causes problems. Oh, the comedic. Uh, co- he, <laughs> I, I can see him just coming out. Yeah, any yeah, scene. Yeah, just yeah, busting yeah. joke. Like, brother, please. That, that, do do you know what's so fucking amazing? Yeah. Who plays that character? The director himself. You, you love the director. I'm telling you, joke you, man. You're ruining it. <laughs> <laughs> joke man. Always trusting jokes. Don't really down two magnums, you know. Fuck. Dross, I'm feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> you must say you're feeling yourself. I swear that thing is dry as so. hell. Nah, nah there's a scene. There's a, there's a one face. I think we're close. You have to wrap on this, you know. Yeah, if you yeah. want to do She-Hulk as well. Whoa, what was it? You don't have time to do She-Hulk. A, there's a face. Hold on, what time are you leaving? I need to leave by 6.30. Oh, my fault. Yeah, we need to be short. Let's watch it anyway. How are you going to talk about She-Hulk? Look <laughs> how long we talked about four. <laughs> no, we'll, we'll make it change. The face he makes here. Is that that, that, that face of desperation? Who? This guy here? Just from going across from here. It's themselves. So this is my vow. You look so sick. Oh, God, she will die. Look, oh, don't mess him up, please. I just want to say that was very, very impressive what you did back there. It's just my first bad guy. You never forget your first. You are not like the other gods of kill. Oh, that face is cold. Oh, that face. Like you, please. You, Look at that face. Look at this face. You can't be a joke, man. You no, can't bust man, jokes. You insane. can't let four just fart. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so obsessed? No, because I just know how he moves. When you know, he somebody, yeah, anyhow they fart. <laughs> there's always a serious moment and the song's just saying stupid. Right, let's make a pack here. If they, if they did a farting, you walk out here. Yeah? I'm walking out. If they did a farting? 100%. If someone farts, I'm walking out. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to be there, bro. I'll make I'm sure like, of it. I told you! <laughs> that I'm going to run out. And no one is going to understand what I mean. Oh uh, boy, um, but now yeah, this this he face looks is sinister and sick. Yeah, bro. this is the face that's that, cold. Bro, is that blood he's got in his mouth? Like like black, black blood. Coming yeah. it's, it's disgusting. Because he, he does. Um, he has this thing where just he, don't he, be funny. Yeah, he has this thing where he absorbs l- uh, the colors of any environment he spent. He's in. Oh really? Yeah, that's. Oh, why that's you know. why he's all black and white. Yeah, and obviously, and, and it, like even Thor and, and Jane Foster was black and white in that one scene. Yeah, when it so he absorbs it. the colors. Yeah, nice. What do you think of um the? No, this whole episode is gonna be a four thing. Right? We'll do the other ones later, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let's spend the last 10 minutes yeah, talking yeah. about the rest of us. What do you think of the fact that he just doesn't look like um, God, 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 but in the comics? Um, be fair, like, for me, it's probably the worst person to ask because um, I never grew up off the comics. I always grew up on, like, animation films and, like, so TV shows. It's really like in the comics. Um, yeah, I saw the pictures of it. Yeah. Um, for me, like I said, I don't read the comics, so it's not it doesn't bother me too much. Yeah. Um, it's still, like, a quick... It, like, the thing is, you have to understand, like like you said briefly about, in terms of, like, the comic books and the movies, there's going to be, like, a, a change. Mm. They can't just copy it completely. I think Christian They want to revamp, yeah. ramp, ramp it a certain way. And obviously, actors <laughs> actors want to be dressed a certain way as well. I, don't think, I, I think Christian was never going to do it. was never going to do the prosthetics thing. Yeah. Like, it, like, it, remember, it, remember um, what's her name again? Jennifer, Jennifer Lawrence. Oh, like, uh, she, Mystique, didn't wanna, she, she didn't want to do the blue stuff. Yeah, that's why she spent most of her time as a human. Yeah. She, she wrote into the story. Yeah, and, and then she got, like, the director... Mm. But the next film kind of convert, convinced her to like, like I beg you, just yeah, 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 but that's a that's a process, bro. Like even him doing the makeup, but I can guarantee, I can stopped, guarantee, though. yeah, the paint stops here. <laughs> the paint probably stops right around yeah. here. But like, but even, like for for example, for him, like what we said briefly, like he's a method actor. Like yeah, he yeah. wants, he don't want to be dressed up. So he it's just wants way, to be in yes, because it's because he will transform his entire body, but he's not on a prosthetic thing. 
because that's faked him. Well, I'm speaking yeah. for him, but I don't yeah. know. But to me, yeah, because he could have he could have done the belly thing, but that's yes, faked him. He doesn't only feel like he's putting a costume mm-hmm. on. He just want to do his thing as him. I'm assuming I don't know him. Yeah, I don't no, know him. You, you, you ain't got man, you got his digits. But this image right here, boy, just don't make no jokes. You can't make jokes to a brother that looks like this. Like, how do he, he, he has no sense of humor. He's not going to laugh. He's like, what the fuck was that, bro? <laughs> it's like. Right, bro, I just think anything, and I, I do, but I, I think, I think Taika is one of those people that would like look at that last movie and think, you know what? I fucked up here. I'm not going to make the same mistake twice. I mean, he didn't fuck up. He did a good job. No, no, no. I'm saying he fucked up. Like, it wasn't 100% amazing. Like, even that one scene where, yeah. where Asgard blew up and he made that one joke. Yeah. He's going to look at that and think, why the fuck did I do that? And then make sure he rectifies that like, in the next movie. Make sure. Like, I, I think so. this, that's one of the main reasons why he's made this movie. I hope so. That this is one re- main reason why I made this movie so that he doesn't eat, like he learns from his mistakes and makes a better movie. It looks better. This movie looks look the trailer. The spirit looks better than, and I don't know if that's more towards that. That's more like towards the trailer. The people where actually make the trailers, or is it because the movie is is impossible to make this movie look look bad? Yeah. But it says even visually, like, visually in some of the scenes, like shit, like this this movie, it, it feels it feels better. Yeah. It feels like Taika two. You know what I'm saying it's, it feels like four two, not four 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 two because the first one. And the, the third one and the fourth one, they're very, very different. They feel like completely different stories and yes, completely different. Yes, like, yes, yes, yes. So it feels a like a revamp to him as well. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a soft, a little bit of a soft rebook. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping for the best, man. That's all I can really say. I'm hoping for the best. Imagine seeing that shit when you wake up, man. Fucking hell, bro. Just, just be you lose a your dark shit. demon that you're meant to be in, in, this, in this film. That's all orange, I'm orange eyes as well. That's. Yeah. Hey, I don't think orange. I don't think there's any other eyes scarier than orange eyes. They definitely play with the the color. Like that he takes colors. Yeah, so but I see orange eyes if he takes colors. It's so interesting. 